You may have heard of battery farms, the giant facilities storing solar and wind power in lithium cells. But what if I told you the biggest batteries of the future aren't built on land, they're buried beneath it? I'm talking about salt. Yep, the very same salt you put on your chips or fries, depending on which country you're from. Except this salt has been sitting underground for hundreds of millions of years, silent, untouched, until now. All over the world, buried beneath layers of rock and soil, there are these massive slabs of salt, formed from ancient seas evaporating, some of them are kilometers thick and stretch for miles. A present day example would be the Mediterranean Sea. And for engineers and geologists, these are gold. Here's what they do. First, they drill down into the salt and inject fresh water. This dissolves into a brine and then it's pumped back out. What's left behind is a smooth, sealed underground cavern. And it's these caverns which are now being turned into batteries. And not the ones that you have in your phones or electric cars. No, these store hydrogen. More importantly, green hydrogen, created by using renewable electricity from splitting water. And unlike regular batteries, this stuff doesn't fade or discharge over time. You could store it there for months. Because here's the thing about renewables. We all know that the sun sets, the wind dies down, and when that happens, we need a way to keep the lights on. That's why we struggle to use renewables indefinitely. And that's where hydrogen steps in because it's stored in these salt caverns, ready to power regions when the grid falls short. And you're probably wondering why salt? Why not any other reservoirs? Well, weirdly enough, it's kind of perfect for this. It's impermeable, which means gases can't pass through it. And when it's under pressure, it flows. Meaning that if there's ever a crack, the salt basically heals itself. Each cavern can hold terrible hours of energy. That's enough to stabilize a grid, not just for hours, but for weeks. But it's also kind of tricky because you can't just do this anywhere. You need to have deep, thick salt beds and mostly in places that were once oceans. The US Gulf Coast, Northern Europe, parts of Middle East, Australia, China. So while salt caverns are a game changer for some regions, others will need different storage solutions. And this isn't just theory. There is a site in Utah currently being made that will store enough hydrogen to power 150,000 homes for an entire season. The vision here goes beyond electricity. Hydrogen can power ships, factories, even planes. This isn't just storage, it's a potential fuel source. The future of clean energy might be hiding in the most ancient, quiet places beneath our feet. If you enjoyed this video, like, comment, share, follow, and I'll see you in the next one.